Hello students, today I will discuss a topic of class 7, subject chemistry, chapter 7, air and atmosphere. Students, in the previous video we have discussed the first key concept atmosphere and we have also started the second key concept that is nature and composition of air. Let us first of all revise what we have discussed in the previous video. Atmosphere the blanket of air that surrounds the earth. The blanket of air that surrounds the earth is called atmosphere. And in the second key concept we have discussed air is a mixture of gases. It contains gases like nitrogen 78%, oxygen 21%, carbon dioxide 0.03%, water vapor 0.04%, and inert gases 0.9 percent today we will continue with the second key concept that is nature and composition of air in this key concept there are few activities so let us discuss the activities activity 7.1 aim of the activity 7.1 is to show that air contains carbon dioxide gas in this activity, first of all, we have to take a test tube. In this test tube, we have to take some lime water. Then we will cover this test tube with a rubber cork which has two holes. Through these two holes, we have to insert two pipes, two tubes. As you can see, one bent long tube is inserted and one short bent tube is inserted. After inserting these bent tubes, we will blow air through the long bent tube. Through this long bent tube, we will blow air. After some time, we will see that lime water has turned milky. The lime water has turned white. Why this lime water has turned white? The lime water has turned white, milky, because of this reaction. Let us see what is the reaction. Lime water CaOH whole 2 plus carbon dioxide. That carbon dioxide is present in the air that we have blown. Carbon dioxide reacts with lime water and forms calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate is white in color and that's why the lime water has turned milky because of the formation of this calcium carbonate CaCO3. So this is the activity 7.1. It shows that carbon that air contains carbon dioxide. Now come to the activity 7.2. In this activity the aim is to show air contains water vapor. In this activity first of all we will take a glass tumbler we will add cold water to it and then we will put some ice cubes in this water. We will add some ice cubes in this water. We will let the glass stay in open for a while. For some time we will let it stay open. After some time we will see that tiny water droplets have appeared on the outer surface of the glass tumbler. From where these tiny droplets have come? These tiny droplets of water has come from the atmosphere. So the conclusion is these droplets must have come from the air. The water vapor present in the air gets condensed to form droplets on coming in contact with cold surface of the glass tumbler. The water vapor that is present in the air after coming with in contact with this cold tumbler it gets condensed to form tiny droplets of water. So this was the activity to show that air contains water vapor. Now students I am giving you few assignments. Read the chapter up to the key concept nature and composition of air and 
write an activity to show that air contains water vapor. Students, do these assignments in your fair notebook. Thank you.